let's export our data in our database into csv file in order to do that we'll use a leak csv package so let's start by uh, installing this all right after that is installed let's switch to sublime so i have existing project called not notebook app and so let's go to our routes web.php i will create a new route i'll call it export so just for demo purpose otherwise i'll put this in inside controller i'll create a closer for now so first we'll get uh, data which we want to export uh, then we'll create a csv file in memory so that we can uh, put the data uh, we get in this step in inside that csv and then we'll insert data and then we'll output okay so first let's uh, get data uh, for now we'll export our data in our user table so we'll get user all and then create a new file in memory like so csp uh, we can use this uh, writer create from file object and then we'll pass new like create from file object and then pass a uh, spell temp file object so this will uh, create a new csp in memory so in order to use this writer we can import it here use leak so uh, while inserting data first we'll insert header then insert rows so inserting will take place in two ways two steps so let's get a header so headers will be these so we can use this uh, schema facade for that uh, get column listing will get us a header so here we need to pass the name of table so that is user okay let's uh, dump this header so let's go to export okay sorry about that it's users there we go we got an uh, array of keys array of our column so what we can do is we can uh, insert it into our csv so call csv and we got insert one method and we'll insert header so our first uh, row is done which is header next we'll insert our rows so for that we'll loop through this users variable and we'll insert each of data each data so let's do that so for each users uh, yeah we don't need this we can do users as user we can do csv uh, insert uh, one and we can insert this user so uh, this user is a collection so object so we need to convert this to array since we can only insert array so to array method will convert this into array all right so inserting part is done let's output this into file so that we can download so in order to output csp uh, we can call output method and then we can pass the name 
exported users so this will be just uh, this will just be the name of csv that uh, will be downloaded and after that we can do die to stop execution of for the code all right so that should work let's uh, go to route export okay there is small typo insert one sorry about that okay there we go so uh, we imported that file so we can do uh, like dot csv so that it will be it will be downloaded uh, in the csv file so once again let's switch to this start export yeah there it is exported so as you can see uh, the data from password and remember token uh, couldn't be inserted uh, that is because laravel by default uh, hides these two fields so if we call any method like uh, sorry uh, like this here we are getting all the user and here we are getting individual user so uh, this uh, will not contain those two columns so yeah so I'm taking the example of this um, user model so in real life you might not want to export these or if you want to export these you can just remove these two hidden from here and then try again and you'll be good to go okay let's try once more so let's visit that route export so here we go let's open it up yeah so this time we got password and remember right both fields so this is a quick way to export your data so uh, we do not cover validation part so what you can do uh, before inserting this uh, you can do some validation and then insert like you want to convert this user into a string to lore or whatever so that is about exporting the data to csv file